Hi Cancer, it's Elta here to do your August 2018 general reading. Now it's a general reading so it will not resonate with everyone who views the, the video. If it does resonate with you, like, share, comment, subscribe. If it doesn't, just move on. It's not a big deal. Uh, check your rising and your moon sign, Venus and whatever else people check, okay? All right, thank you to those who have um, subscribed and commented. Remember to comment below because it automatically enters you to win a free reading with me. Okay, and I'm going to announce the winners August 1st, I believe. I'm going to try to do August 1st. Yeah, let's jump into it. We've got our shells here. A lot of pressure on cancer, a lot of pressure. I don't know if it's... um. I don't know what kind of pressure it is if it's financial if it's emotional somebody's not happy I just keep hearing not happy but you just keep going but you're not happy there may be children involved or a child something to do with your children's the other parent could be the mother could be the father yeah uh, some somebody's taking on more than they can chew. Someone is um somebody's contemplating leaving. It's keeping them up at night. Somebody's having dreams about another person. Um, they're fantasizing about something else or another life or, or past life or past you know, <clears throat> past partner just about the past they're just really in the past cancer can do that can live in the past come come to the future come to the present um there might be some money issue somebody's waiting for a payout or they had to pay out some money it might be a divorce pending or Someone is um, thinking of, of divorce and how that looks for them monetarily. Someone is trying to um, un unravel or untangle themselves or untangle the life that they made with somebody else. They're trying to like get their own stuff and really be um, super independent if I mean not that you're not but you're really trying to like if you share something with someone else an account or whatever you're really trying to stop that and just have your own things some of you have people uncertain about where they stand with you some of you have grown cold some of you dealing with somebody who dealt with you for a very long time and um you did a lot of stuff to them. They did a lot of stuff in a relationship, but they never chose to leave. Leaving was an option, but they never chose to leave because you provided something for them and they chose to stay. But they never forgave you. And maybe you never forgave them, but I'm really feeling like they never really forgave you for all of the injustice and all of the, you know, um, maybe the infidelity. Uh, so they're really tough to deal with and really bitchy really and they have a high sense of entitlement because that's you know how you always want them back with things or with you know you create an illusion uh, for them and for yourself uh, some of you need to check on your health uh, exercise blood work this highlighted here uh, some of you um, I don't like saying that. <clears throat> so, um, some of you know somebody's secret, and it's in regards to their health, um, particularly <laughs> an STD. You know, something of something of that nature. You know their health. You know their status. They know yours, or something of that nature. Something's in, intertwined there. <laughs> Uh, you know, okay, let's get into the love messages for Cancer. 
Alright. Thank you, Heavenly Father, for four cards for Cancer. What are the love messages for Cancer? Love messages for Cancer. Love messages for Cancer. Bottom of the deck, the three of fire. It looks like some of you may be uh, waiting for something or waiting for someone, waiting for a message, waiting for the opportunity to take action, to start building with someone, to go to the four of fire. You're, you're definitely in that boat waiting to um, sail off in, into a new direction here. Maybe with a fire sign, sun, moon, and rising, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. Let's see what this is about. All right, five of water, page of earth, king of water, will of fortune. Yeah, it looks like it might have been, there is interjection. There is some something on the outside. There is someone on the outside of a, an established relationship um, that you possibly like I said you want to deal with messages of stability elsewhere uh, you're waiting to um, build elsewhere you're already gr going through the grieving process you know that this is going to happen that you're going to have to let go of uh, have change to get exactly what you want and it's like what the will of fortune here is destined to happen you know it and you're kind of going with the flow um, <clears throat> you could be dealing with a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio like yourself, Sun, Moon, Rising, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. Um, some of you have already started building elsewhere also. Um, yeah, third party situation. But even in the midst of, you know, having another party, there is one that you you really want to have something solid and stable what you want to have a real relationship with and you're waiting for the opportunity three of fire here leaving but you know that you're gonna have to leave behind old partnership or old establishment old the old and move forward you're hiding your feelings about it too in the midst of your new relationship or even with the um the new person, the new person doesn't even know your plans or quotes per se. Um, they don't know how deeply you feel about, you know, this situation or about the relationship that you two have. Okay, let's get into some career and finance messages. Okay, career and finance messages. justice okay some of you could be dealing with the legal system waiting for a payout waiting for some news in regards to something legal yeah waiting for something legal to end um some of you it might be even be child support yeah. what did i say nine of swords queen of swords queen queen of pentacles yeah Waiting to in the bottom of the deck, the um, lovers, Gemini. Um, some of you might be waiting, yeah. Some of you might have a Gemini for um, your child's mother or your child's father. You're waiting for either a payout from this person or you're waiting to stop having to make payments to this person. You feel like this person is all about money. Um, they're cold. They're being a little calculated. It's stressing you out. You want an end to it. You want to put an end to this. Um, you're waiting for a decision about, yeah, 
you're waiting for a decision about uh, financial matters. So for some of you, your job is stressing you. But there's also something else or someone else who is who requires so much of you, even if it's so much money or energy. They uh, they want you to do everything. A lot is on your shoulders. A lot is on you. You need balance. You're trying to find balance. Some of you are maybe divorcing a Libra also. Scorpio is here. Gemini. Um, Capricorn Virgo Taurus. Uh, Aquarius. Libra. But this is typically Gemini. Um, some of you really trying to cut the fat see if, in the sense of something or someone maybe that you've been partnered to is really um, hindering you for ha from ha having more money like they spend a lot of money or they want you to spend a lot of money it's something about a lot you want to put an end to you want to put an end to either a long-standing relationship uh, child support some legality is here alright let's get some additional messages of support from our butterfly oracle cards additional messages of support Some of you are trying to decide to walk away from um, a marriage, what it looks like financially. It's keeping you up at night, the stress. Okay, we've got volunteer, end of an era, finances, yep. Okay, and we got support and sentimental feelings. Bottom of the deck, take the next, next step. Uh, I think Jim and I have this at the bottom of the deck. Take the next step. Um, <clears throat> so end of an era. Something's ending here. Yeah, we've got the Wheel of Fortune. The Nine of Swords. It's not without heavy contemplation and grief. But something is ending here. I mean, you can't just go on any longer. I mean, you could, but it's draining. It's draining your finances. It's draining your energy. Support is here. You feel like you if you make this change, everyone will be against you. You have sentimental feelings here. And that's not something you want to have in a love relationship. You want to have your emotions involved. You want to love. You don't want to have the sentiment of, oh, you know, it's it's more, you know, obligation. Sentimental feelings is just, you know... I remember when I loved you. Now I just feel sorry for you or I feel stuck. You know, that sentimental feeling. Some of you need to volunteer uh, the truth. And you need to volunteer um, something about a settlement, an amount, or you need to volunteer uh, an opportunity for the other person. If you're the breadwinner, take the next step now. If it's about getting away from or untangling yourself take the next step now and it might have something to do with the legal system uh, let's see okay this kept popping out for you off camera big happy changes so whenever you make the change it's going to be so happy for you you know but you have to stop holding on to things or a person that just doesn't serve you unlikely it's unlikely that the situation is going to turn out you know in, in the best light but you've got to do what you got to do it's unlikely it's unlikely that you guys are it's going to turn around and you guys are going to live happily ever after and ride off into the sunset it's unlikely uh, things have gone too far have gone unspoken not talked about not communicated for too long helpful people and you have support people will help you 
Oh, way too many. One more and we're out of here. Ask for help from others a year from now. Okay. Bottom of the deck, meditation brings answers. All right, I hope that this helped every cancer out. Um, I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. All of my information is below if you need to get in contact with me for a personal reading. Take advantage of the one question, $10 reading, okay? Um, <clears throat> that link is below also go over to my website book a reading um, cancer remember when in doubt pray meditate meditation brings answers all right take care cancer see you and we'll talk to you august mid-august yeah